everybody, welcome to Bar and Pilates. We are going to focus today on sculpting the muscles in our calves and in our quadriceps. We're gonna also do some mat work to really shred the abdominals and the obliques. Let's get to work. We're in a wide second position, heels in, toes out. We're gonna plie and lift, plie and lift. Good, plie and lift. Keep going right here. And then we'll be all warmed up. 
And then we're really going to amp up the intensity. Good. I'm gonna go back to that other side. We're still in the second position. So our feet are a little wider than our shoulders. And it's a plie. Up on your toes, plie. Up on your toes, plie. Never slouch. Don't do this. Stand tall. Also, don't do such a big exaggerated arch. Keeping the spine straight. Deep plie. Engaging the inner thighs. Should really feel like all of your thighs are working. The front, the side, the back. Every muscle in your leg is working on this move because it's such a deep plie and then a big lift at the end. Last one, switch sides. I'm gonna turn around for this one. Getting nice and wide, standing nice and tall, deep reach, deep down, way up, play it, and lift. Keep on going. Almost done with 
It's still a second position. It's a plie and a knee. Plie, knee, plie, knee. Keep working hard right here for 10, nine, good. Shoulders, plie, knee, plie, knee. Keep going, keep going. Twist. 
one of your shoulder blades is up off the mat. Some people think of it as elbow to knee. What's really more important is what's going on with your core, meaning your back, your abs. There should be a major twist rotation in your spine, shoulders, back, hips. This whole area, Joseph Pilates called it the powerhouse. Now, let's do one side, left, left, up and over, up and over. See how that shoulder blade is going up and down, up and down, using those obliques, switch sides, stay on this side. Up and over, up and over. My right shoulder blades stay down, my left ones go up and over, up and over. Good, release. Now we're gonna go back to rectus abdominis, this big, long, six-pack muscle. We are going to do scissors, 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 scissors. Good, keep those shoulder blades up off the floor. Don't forget to breathe. Good. Go. 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 Here's 10. Shoulders up high. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Release. Let's do another stretch. Shoulders down. Don't let them bunch up. Keep them low. Chin up, chest forward. Do a little wiggle. And roll it back over. Now let's do the rocker. So, it's fun, it looks fun and it is fun, but it's also really hard and challenging to stop right here. Your body wants to keep in motion and be stopped by hitting the floor. It takes a lot of control of the abdominal muscles to hit the brakes and stop the motion, right? That's physics. Good. Kick the ceiling, roll up and stop. Kick the ceiling, roll up and stop. Control. Keep going. This is too much. Do it with your hands on the floor. This is a great way to start. Still gonna be really good exercise, challenging your core muscles, I promise. If you wanna go higher intensity, and this is just an option, don't kill me. Add a teaser at the top. A teaser is like a V, or you're like a pike, and it's like kind of fun. You can 
touch your feet, touch them, extend, touch them, extend. Another option is touch them and lift, touch, lift. Whichever way you do it, you should feel your core engaging. Let me know in the comments, I read every single one. Forceful exhale, good. Stay up here. Let's do a little bit more oblique engagement with a twist. A twist. Lean back, halfway back. You're not sitting up all the way. Twist, twist, twist. Knee to elbow. Twist, twist. Rotate really super far. Lean back, lean back. Here's 10. Nice, 
to move sit up so make sure you can see my form and it's gonna be a big exhale and scoop it up crown of the head to the ceiling long spine now we round our back only on the way down one vertebrae at a time we slowly control it back we exhale up and reach tall spine slowly control it down one vertebrae at a time release exhale up and lift inhale down slow and control don't flop it down exhale up and reach slowly control it down slowly control it down good hop hop slow 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 good just a few more Here's the last one. Now I would like to do some oblique crunches, twists. We're gonna really do a burnout. These are important muscles. Twist, twist. Exhale every time. Hup, hup, hup. Work it out. Can you twist a little further? Can you lift a little higher? Go, go, go. Go. Now doubles, doubles, two on the left, two on the right. Keep going with the doubles, keep going. Next, we're gonna change it, triple, triple, triple. Switch sides, that's three, switch. Three, two, one, switch. Two, one, switch. Two, one, switch. Two, one, last time. Stretch and extend. Good. Let's go ahead and take it back to a standing position. Meet me right back here. 